Blake. Colby. That's right. I'm leading this into this one. Because we're going right to the next chapter in David's Day of Reckoning. You got my jargon. What happened last time, Colby? Last time? I think we got the icy title. I don't know. It was like a week and a half ago, two weeks. I don't know. Let's continue. Yeah, Randy. Listen, we're we're getting close. It's almost Royal Rumble season, brother, and then we're on the road to WrestleMania. Fourth week of December. That's my birthday. But there's week. a bounty on David's head. Jesus. It's like uh. Are we gonna fight Boba Fett? It's like when Evolution put a bounty on Goldberg's head. What does that mean? It means it's like if you beat up Goldberg, we're gonna give you fifty thousand dollars or something. Really? Like anywhere? Okay, I go to a parking lot. Yeah, we can. You know, get a stun gun or something. Are we going to beat the shit out of David? Well, we're David. Right, but I mean in real life. Yes. Listen, if someone came up to me and said, would you beat up David for $50,000? Oh, yeah. Um, David would have broken legs. Um. Wow, Jesus. Have you ever seen those posts where it's like the tiny little bunny and it's like step on him for a million dollars? And then it's like someone like breakdancing or something? No. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> no, it's like... Uh, let you comment. Somebody comments and like, yo, nobody said I had to hit him hard. I tapped that little, I tapped that little dude on the head and then, uh, uh, throw him a stack for his troubles. How wholesome. I know. <laughs> Who are we fighting? Benjamin this Franklin? This is Shelton Benjamin. He's, uh, friends. Oh! <laughs> and former tag partners with Brock Lesnar. Okay. You know who Brock Lesnar is? Yeah, I know who Brock Lesnar is. Na name I one. Around. Name one na letter in his name, if you're such a fan. Uh, four. I knew you were a poser. <sighs> More like Brock Lesnar. Listen, I'm pretty sure there was gonna be an angle after this match, brother. Like Kurt Angle? No. You know what an angle is? A uh, twist? Like a wrestling angle, brother. There's gonna be some story stuff after this match because we're just facing Shelton Benjamin for no reason. Yeah, it's true. So, so I feel like filler. I feel yeah. like we're going to get beat up after oh. this match. This is the filler arc, dude. Dude, we, David's gotten his ass kicked after a match so many times now. I don't yeah, think they man. know that route. You would think he'd like see it coming by but, now. But there's a bounty on our head. Yeah, but we're going to like fight him off. Uh. Or is like Django Fett going to get us and shoot a dart in our neck and we die? I saw a post of, of like a edited picture of like from I think it's Phantom Menace where like one of the Fets dies the and third then one. like is it the third oh, second one? Season. Yeah, that's what I said. Fan no, I meant I meant Attack of the Clones. Jesus. I, I'm I'm picturing like that that desert place and everyone's there and what Mace oh. Windu's there and stuff. Oh Geonosis. Sure. There's two desert places where the Fets die. <laughs> How unfortunate. Um yeah you're, Whoa. Thinking, you're thinking of Shiboyo uh Django Fett by the hands of Samuel L. Jackson. Yeah. So, like, he, he's... He, whoa! Is this the one where the kid... Where his son is holding his helmet and, yeah. his, and his head falls out? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Talk about a bad day. Because you had a bad day. Your uh -oh! father was... We just sweet chin music to you. But we knocked out the ref. I can't believe you just got super kicked, dude. It's all good. You knocked out the ref. Can't pin us. Break. See? You're a chump. You're a chump. Man, imagine if like football players could do that to to referees. What, just like knock, knock out, out the ref? Can you imagine? Like the whole play would be like, all right, you two fuck up that ref, you two fuck up that ref. Ooh, that was weak. Come on. Oh, oh. <gasps> Ooh. Wow. Oh, then you made out with him. Damn. Oh, I thought you got him back in the ring. <laughs> Hit something. Listen, right. I'm going to do the move. It never works. It never works. I think we got it to work once. They can't be like right up against the. Yeah, the you, you you fly too Let far. Let me try again. <laughs> Wee. Ooh. We're gonna. Wah! Oh shit. Uh oh. He has his finish He's again. His ultimate move. No oh, shit. His oh, ultimate no. move. Oh no! Here it comes. Oh. The back hit. No. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. Give All him. Right. The, give him the the ultimate move. I can't. I don't have Do my it. finish yet. Do it. That's it. The consecutive punch in the face. Listen. Until I don't he know spits why, out of his nipple. But I feel like, you know, this is just like. All right. Answer me for real. What? <laughs> what if? Uh huh. 
like you're about to pin him. Yep. And then we get a cutscene of Nemesis coming out of the bottom of the ring and and taking David away. Honestly, it could happen. No, I think so. And he's like, stars. Honestly, let's find out. All right, here we go. Count them. Count them, ref. Uno. Dos. Trade. We beat him. Easy does it. Wow, you pray. You prayed. I, I tripped. <laughs> oh no. Yep. All right. If you if he gets his ass kicked, I'm gonna be like very disappointed in David. Listen, David's a chump. Like, dude, just look behind you. Just close your eyes, brother. <laughs> what the hell? Oh no. See. Oh, oh it's, it's my favorite. The heartbreak kid. Do his voice. He's from Texas, San Antonio, oh, Texas. Hey, David, I don't know if you've heard the news yet, but you better watch your back. What are you talking about? Rumor has it that Triple H and Flair have put a bounty on your head. Thank you, Sean. And that means that just about anybody in the locker room has an incentive to fucking kill you. Anybody, huh? Is that right? I, I, don't worry about me. I've crossed paths with Triple H enough times in the past to know better than to play his stupid games. I wouldn't take his money, but just about anybody else probably would. I'm gonna betray you. Nope. Like I said, you better not trust anyone. And sleep with one eye open. <laughs> you better sleep with that cybernetic eye open. If you catch my drift. I'll do. I do. <laughs> I'll be on the fuck. Well, 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 we finally got HBK. Yeah. I think that's it for today's episode. Oh, no. Wow. Okay. <laughs> What's your turn? <laughs> I think, all right, I my, think my you prediction, your next, next show, wait, profile, profile pick, um, next show, Got the looks. we're gonna, we're gonna get the thing, that drive, the girls, I just you know pump, pumped up our counter, like two yeah, points. oh yeah, we need that counter, I got brother. the moves, maybe it means like easier to counter, cause I feel like I'm hitting the button, and yeah, like, maybe, that really move them. Okay, we're in Hell in a Cell. Wait, no. The big red bounty hunter. Kane? Oh, no, that's Kane. Uh, ah! Bob. Oh, wait, wrong. Wrong guy. Ugh. Everybody I'll, I'll be Kane. Like I said before, Triple H, oh, no if you want this punk David put on the shelf, I'm just the guy to take care of it for you. I'm the mayor of Knoxville, Tennessee. <laughs> it's all well and good the last day to say that got his ass kicked. I want you to do the job, but we're gonna do it right, no mistakes. Is this like a, it's like a coup? Like yeah. A, uh, you're, you're gonna team up with Randy Orton in a handicap match against David. He sounds like an old Bill Clinton. <laughs> <laughs> and if no when, no, uh, no when you win, you get the bounty. Just leave Orton. The carcass? carcass? Holy fuck. Perfectly clear. You tell Orton, if he donates to my re-election campaign, he's all yours. And the bounty <laughs> will be all mine. Mm, just get the job done, brother. Uh, all right. You're really tall. <laughs> <laughs> Good talk, guys. I wish I was a mayor. I only do Cumberland Farms commercials now. Did you know that? Who? Rick Flair. Flair. Dude, look at Ric Flair Cumberland Farms commercial. Oh, my God. It's he's great, a, He's dude. a Cumbies fan, dude, brother? Dude, it's so... Sad, like it's, it's is it? It's just like really pathetic. All right, Cumberland. It's like when people make jokes about like car salesman commercials. Like, ah, he just became a used car salesman. That's like what it looks like. Ric Flair, Cumberland Farms, and the Nature Boy. <laughs> Handicap Matt. This sucks. They didn't even give him a strip, dude. They were just like, say woo a lot. Uh, we'll put subtitles. Farms. Yeah. Which they did. They actually did. Thank God. I need to know that riveting dialogue. Listen, would you buy a Cumlin Farm sandwich? I, I have to. F I remember in high school, I like. What the definitely... fuck? Was... High school? <laughs> yeah, in high school. I was very much digging uh, Ribbit sandwiches from 
fucking Cumberland Farms. Gas station Ribbitu sandwiches. Is it gross? Yeah. But like, you know, that's what I liked. Uh, I, remember, I was never healthy. Kid. I remember I was going somewhere, like on a road trip or something, like somewhere, right? And like, I, I got like a, oh. I got a sandwich from Jesus. Cumberland Farms and you have the option for them to heat it up. And they did, and I was like, wow, this sucked. Yeah, wow, is this Subway? Eat flesh. Wow! Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, fuck that guy. I have like, I've had like empanadas from Cumberland Farms. Name Fairly one. Fairly recent. Name one. Uh, an empanada. What flavor? I don't know, chicken? <laughs> Cheese? It's like, goddamn, do you even know what an empanada is? Yeah, it's that like Prima closed Donna. like half moon thing, right? Ha the half moon. Yeah. Yeah, you know. It's a half circle. Yeah, fuck that guy. Yo, pin him! Break! Break. <laughs> nope. I oh, scared the referee out. Listen, you are so strong. You know how heavy uh, you'll Kane the, is? You have the occasional like, one punch I give. You mean that clothesline of doom? Damn. Oh, you're stomping the mud hole. No <coughs> breathing. Look at Randy Orton watch as his friend's bleeding. <laughs> Listen, that's not his friend. That's his... Get in here. At best. I want both business of you. Apartment. I want this to be a real handicap, please. Oh, it's David, like a pile driver. Is David, kind of is David strong? Is David God? No, no, no. This is an IRL question. Oh, um, is David packing the muscles, bro? Is he lifting those weights, brother? I don't know if he watches brother? the series. He doesn't, probably. I think so he watched like, the, the second episode. Weird. You know Weird. who does watch? All Beat of you new out there. 3, does Beat new 3000. Beat new 3000. Yeah. All right, David. David. All right, uh, beat, no, I didn't beat new 3000. I just, that was the beat. If you oh. think David's strong, uh, say so, I guess. Do we have a panda or one? Yes. Our, our, uh. Boy. I don't, don't get me wrong. He's I a good boy. Oh my or God. girl. I don't know. I think it's a boy. We'll see. But uh, that's assuming. Yeah, we don't assume things. We just right, keep tapping X. <sighs> Um, Stop slapping your fish together over there, bro. So, you're not sorry, not ref. Oh, ref, ref, ref I'm sorry, ref, ref. Please. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh shit! It's a handicap, Matt. Do it. Oh, <laughs> coward. Give him, the, give him the old one-two. Whoa! <laughs> a, A, B, A, B. The power the bottom. The power bottom. <sighs> did I get DQ? Did I beat up the you're ref? A fucking bomb, dude. <laughs> did I press the wrong button? All right, all right. That was a warm up. Start the match right. I always do it. I always do it. You're a bomb, man. You're a bomb. Whoa. None of that even happened, dude. Listen. Whoa. What if you like flew over the ropes? That would You'd be feel a real and bad. You, like right into the crowd. All right, and then that song played. The now 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 now. Oh, like when they going into space? Yeah. Like that <laughs> meme. You know that one song, right? Yeah. Name, 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 name their album. Actually, I did look up the song recently. Oh yeah, what's uh, it called? Last week, actually. Empanada I forgot, Extraordinaire. I it doesn't matter. It's actually they, they played the it live. And it, dude, it's not my fault. Kane's such a big fucking dude. He is a big dude, and he has a broken spine right now. In real life? No, <laughs> he's the mayor of Knoxville, Tennessee. <laughs> I, I, I get that. Whoa. Oh my god. <laughs> hey. Whoa. Uh, uh, oh. Ref, ref, you seen this? Ref? Hey. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, that like that was like an ultra instinct dodge. <laughs> yeah, fuck that pimp. Or that. Fucking pin the back of your head to this fucking mat. Oh, kiss him. Kiss ah! him. <gasps> no. Yo. Ow. What if he just pinned me in one? <laughs> I mean, I I could see it honestly. What? What are you doing, Whoa. kid? <laughs> Yo, he threw you by your neck. That <gasps> feels like it's <gasps> seems like it's uncomfortable. No, 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 no! Get him! Get him! Okay, I want both of them. <laughs> but now he has no damage. Is that so? Oh, now he has a broken back. Break! Break that! Oh, break! Oh. oh, oh, he's pinning me. He got the schoolboy. 
That's what that move's called, by the way. Oh, you, bro, you just hulked up. I don't know why I hulked up. But to up. no avail. That's my secret, Cap. I'm always David. He's pinning me. I'm going to lose. Knock out. Kick out. Black out. Freak out. <laughs> what? You're just saying things. You're saying are we, things. Are we at that age in our YouTube career? I hate that move. That's the Listen, worst Listen, what are we on? Year three? Four? Seven? Get in here. Oh, I feel like it's year three, right? Yeah, probably year three. Makes sense. Give or take. I mean, In November yeah. it'll be a year. I mean, the channel, the, the channel's older technically than, than, than our content. You know what I'm saying? Oh, did you see that? Your judo, oh, chop. your judo chop. Thanks, Wing. Wing, whoa. Wing Chun. I know our our master. Our Sifu. If you will. He, he took us under. Take that is our. Uh, he wing? took. He took. A, yes. His wing, uh, he, wing took All us right. under his wing, and we became. A both Jedi and Ninja Master. Whoa, we're a Jedi? Yes. <gasps> Jedi. Okay, use your move. Hey. Alright. <laughs> no, he's gonna break it. Uh, okay, this might be good because uh Kane's like getting in the ring animation is really slow. No 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 use it no, on I Orin. wanted to die. <sighs> Fine. Let's do all the things that you wanna do. Boy. Maybe I want to win my own way. Stop being a batsy gamer. Listen, I'm like McDonald's. Have it your way, brother. All right, pin him. Pin him. Do it for David. Well, you Unacceptable. Piece of work. Ah! Bro, <laughs> Kalima! That's the military press. Did you yeah, know they do that Randy Orton was in the military? Was he? And he was uh, discharged. For what? I don't remember. Okay, I'll 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 find out. For supporting Al Qaeda. <laughs> no, um, that um no, uh, no, nope. Oh, uh oh. Okay, Randy. Is this the end? Or in discharge. He was dishonorably discharged. Dishonorably discharged. All right, here's the here's the scoop. The down low. At at the base, he received a bad conduct discharge in 1999 after going AWOL on two occasions and disobeying an order from a commanding officer. Under the Uniform Code of Military Justice, he was tried and convicted under a special court martial. So subsequently, spending 38 days in the in the in the brig at Camp Pendleton. Wanna So that's um, that's. That's Randall. Oh. Wow. I think you know a guy. I mean, he, yeah, whatever. Oh, what's happening? <gasps> it's oh, Eric. It's easy, yay. I mean, I said that this is the yeah, second did that time before, I said that. Yeah. All right, Kermit. Well, it seems that based on your behavior in recent weeks, Randy Orton doesn't want to let this feud go. For real. And if I know the Intercontinental Champion, he's also anxious to see it right through to its bitter end. I don't know about that. I just, so, in the interest of settling this match once and for all, let me see if I can help by upping the states just a bit. Where's Kane? Next week, right here on Raw, we're going to see uh, if you two gentlemen can solve your differences in a cell. Whoa. Oh, in the cell, to be more specific. What the fuck? Yes, it's going to be with you, Randy Orton, versus you, David, in a non-title Hell in the Cell match. Why is it non-title? Non-title? Why should I get into a cell next week if it's not for the championship? Yeah, I think he's got a point. This punk stole my title two weeks ago. I deserve a chance to win it back. You were kicked out of the military, Randy. Get out of here. You see, as you may be aware, in just two weeks in the WWE, it's going to be holding its very special cross-brand pay-per-view. The Royal Whoa. Rumble. You know, the 30-man over-the-top event where the winner gets the world title shot? I recall. Thank, thank you, Eric. Well, as the GM of this fine program, I was able to procure the number 29 entry slot for one very lucky member of Raw. Wow. Who that person is, however, is still undecided. Fortunately, I know of at least two worthy candidates deserving of this very advantageous distinction. And they are, they are standing in the very ring right this minute. So, as I promised, I've raised the stakes for your match next week. Your match is not going to be for the prestigious Intercontinental title. Oh, mm. no, no, no. Ah! The stakes are even <laughs> higher. Ah. The winner of next week's Hell in the Cell match will earn the number 29 slot in the Royal Rumble. What? Number 29 slot? That sounds dress, dude. Ah, uh, but let me finish. With great reward comes great risk. 
You see, the man who loses next week's Hell in the Cell match will not be in the Royal Rumble at all. Uh, uh, Nanny? Uh, uh. All right, bye. Wow, that's it. Did yeah. you, didn't even say goodbye. Listen, goodbye. we're gonna we're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this Hell in a Cell quickly. I'm gonna beat him in three minutes. Jesus, and then that's dude. the end of the episode. Three minutes. Because then we have to dedicate an episode to the Royal Rumble. So we can't so, have both the Hell and Cell and a Royal Rumble in the same episode. We can't have Hell and Rumble. Let's do it. Final words. <laughs>